Sheriff Van Duncan says he was surprised after Asheville Police Chief William Anderson ordered an SBI investigation into his actions. Now, this stems from an incident involving the sheriff's son, who was taken for a frightening ride by a man that forced his way into his car back in April. News 13's Frank Faboni joins us with tonight's exclusive story. Frank, why an SBI probe? Darcel, Sheriff Duncan, acting more like a parent than sheriff, took his son back to the scene where he made his escape. The sheriff says his intentions were to call police once he knew where the suspect might be. That's when the suspect approached his unmarked patrol car and the sheriff apprehended him. Up until that night, I didn't realize that I had really failed as a parent to prepare my 16-year-old and what to do if something like that happened. Sheriff Van Duncan says it was probably the most frightening three-minute phone call of his life. Shortly after he left, we got a telephone call and he was in a panic. The sheriff's son had gone to the cookout on Patton Avenue to meet friends on the night of April 15th when a man convinced his son to give him a lift. Someone had asked him to take him to get gas and he had reluctantly uh, submitted to that request but now the guy was in his car and wouldn't get out. They drove to Hillcrest Apartments in the city where the man got out. That's when his frightened son called home. He said yes he's a few feet away from the car but he's out of the car. I said reach over, lock the door and drive home as quick as you can. Hillcrest resident Tyrone Simpson remembers the night the sheriff and his son returned to find the suspect. There's a great charge with tenant windows. The whole street was lined with police cars. The sheriff said his plan was to call police once his son recognized where he dropped the man off. That's when they spotted the suspect running toward their vehicle. I think it was a surprise to him that he was waving down a, a police vehicle. Duncan says he grabbed the man, got his ID, and held him while he called police. I held on to him while I reached in the car. Asheville police said they were charging Larry Shelton, a 34-year-old with a lengthy criminal record. But the next day, it was the sheriff that was under investigation. Yes, I was surprised the next day. Chief William Anderson asked the SBI to investigate after Shelton apparently suggested the sheriff choked him. I was fine with him asking. I understood. Uh, I think he had some limited information when he made that decision. Duncan says Hillcrest video cameras revealed it never happened. There ended up being a tape there in uh, from the Hillcrest system that basically showed exactly what I told him had happened. The sheriff says he felt guilty as a parent and urges everyone to talk to their teenage drivers. You never let anybody in a vehicle with you that you don't know, no matter what the story. We tried to reach Chief Anderson for comment about this story, but he did not respond to our requests. Shelton was charged with felonious restraint and had just been released from prison last year. Larry?